everyone and welcome to my YouTube channel. I am Raluca. This video is going to be all about complexion. I'm going to teach you how to achieve that glowy, juicy skin. Even if your skin is dry or dehydrated and is lacking that natural, healthy glow. But before I start with the tutorial, I want to kindly ask you guys to subscribe to my channel if you're not subscribed already. And yeah, let's get started. This morning when I woke up, I just washed my face and didn't apply any skincare because I wanted to come on here and show you what I do to give my skin that natural glow and my skin feels very tight at the moment <laughs> so the most important step that you want to make is a good skincare routine today i want to try out this serum caps let's say this is a romanian brand Jerovital. they have these um, hyaluronic acid and vitamin c serum these little guys right here one of these is for one use, but it acts like a serum. And I found out that when it comes to the dewiness of my skin, the ingredient that helps me the most is vitamin C. That's why I decided to try these today. They also have hyaluronic acid, which again helps with moisturizing the skin. But you got to make sure that you don't apply it on dry skin because it's going to dry out your skin if you do that. You have to apply it on a damp skin. So I'm going to take my thermal water and spray some of my face to get ready for these little guys. So I'm spraying a little bit of my thermal water to get my skin warm. And I already opened one of these and I'm taking it on my fingers and massaging it into my skin. It's a lot of product here but I'm just going to slowly massage it all in. Let me apply it on my neck, why not? Because <laughs> it's a lot of product anyway. So I'm just going to massage it all in until it absorbs. I like how my skin is feeling very bouncy at the moment. <laughs> now I'm just going to follow up with my regular moisturizers. And first I'm going to apply my eye cream. This is the Inky List Brighten Eye Cream. I like that it has this applicator for some eye area massaging. And it's also cold which helps with the puffing. I'm also applying this on my lid, so I just go like on the eye contour, let's say, kind of like in a circle. And now for my face, I'm going to apply the Dr. Jard Vital Hydra Solution Moisturizer. A serum is not enough to hydrate your skin, you have to seal that hydration in using a cream texture. This is more like gel, but again, it's a moisturizer, not a serum. And again, I'm just going to massage this in. And as you can see, my skin is looking a lot dewier already. Okay, now it's time for the makeup. I, uh, I usually don't apply a primer. You can either use a moisturizing primer, but what's the point because you already moisturize your skin with skincare or you can use a smoothing primer like you have texture open pores stuff like that if you need that smoothing on your skin you can apply them locally only on the parts where you have texture and open pores so anyways i'm going to jump straight into foundation and you need a dewy foundation <laughs> to achieve a dewy look the dewiest foundation that I've tried is the Dior Forever Skin Glow Foundation. So this is what I'm going to use today. Okay, so I'm just going to apply this. As you can see, the foundation is quite liquidy and lightweight. And it doesn't have a lot of coverage. But I prefer that, especially when I want that natural glowy skin and I'm going to blend it in using a sponge I feel like the sponge application gives you a more natural look than the brush application but you do you so I'm just bouncing the sponge on my skin by the way the sponge needs to be damp just so it's here And I'm 
extending it on my neck as well. And if you want like other options, because I know the Dior foundation, it's of course Dior is quite expensive. You could get like the Fenty hydrating foundation, the one that comes in a tube, not in the glass bottle. That one is also great for dry skin. Look at this dewiness. For concealer you can apply whatever you want because it's not that important, you only apply it on your under eyes. And of course on the spot, if you have spots you want to cover. I'd rather use concealer than use a full coverage foundation. And the concealer that I'm going to use today is the Urban Decay Stay Naked Concealer. I'm not going to apply a lot. Just a little bit in my inner portion because I have like a blue spot there. Like so. And a little bit in my other portion to balance things out. And again, for this step, you can use a brush or you can use a sponge, it's up to you. I'm just going to use the sponge because it's easier. <laughs> Just like that, just a little cover up. And now to set my concealer in place, I'm going to use the RCMA No Color Powder. And I'm using a Morphe M330 brush. This is just an eye blending brush, but I like using it for setting down the eyes. I'm getting a lot of creases already. So I'm just going to blend this concealer in and immediately setting my under eyes with some powder. If you have like really really dry skin, you can skip setting your face, but I don't like doing that because my makeup is going to transfer. So I'm going to use a very small amount of powder, something like this. I'm going to take a fluffy brush dust off the excess and very lightly set my entire face, especially the center of my face. I'm just going to quickly do my brows off camera and I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back and now for the rest of your face you kind of want to apply like shimmery everything, <laughs> let's say. So I'm going to start with a shimmery bronzer. This is the NYX Three steps to sculpt palette, or it's the deep shade. I'm just going to take this bronzer right here, and with bronzer you kind of want to spread it like this in circular motions. So it's not a contour powder; it's a bronzer. You can be a little bit less precise with it. See how light reflecting this is. Again, it gives that juicy, natural glow. I'm applying some on the tip of my nose as well. And on my forehead. Why don't I do this more often? I like how the shimmery bronzer looks, I just don't do it as often as I should. <laughs> For blush, I'm going to use this little guy by Makeup Forever. I have no idea what the number is, I'm sorry because it faded. But it's just a shimmery blush. Let me show you, it looks something like this. So as you can see, it's a little bit light reflecting. I'm just going to pick it up on my brush and apply a little bit above that bronzer that we applied. Oh my god, this is a lot. <laughs> I'm just going to fade this a little bit. Same thing on my other side. And a little bit on the tip of my nose, because why not? <laughs> this is a very enormous amount of blush, but I kind of like it. I feel like it's kind of cute. <laughs> and now for highlighter. Dry skin's best friend. <laughs> I'm going to use the Sephora Collection highlighter. This is the face shimmering powder in the shade Natural Glow. 
I love how this gives that natural dewy juicy skin glow and it doesn't look like just glitter on your face you know the brush that I'm using is the Sigma F03 brush and I'm applying some oh it's so beautiful so I'm applying some on my cheek bone on my cheekbone and I'm applying this basically almost all over so above my brows on my chin cupid's bow tip of the nose bridge of the nose <laughs> it's a dewy skin tutorial of course i'm going to use a lot of highlighter and as you can see this looks very natural like skin like glow so beautiful with a small detail brush, I'm going to apply the highlighter on my brow bone and inner corner. And now to finish off this dewy complexion, you need to use a dewy setting spray. And the most common, let's say known, dewy setting spray is the MAC Fix Plus. This is really dewy on the skin, and the more you apply, the dewier your skin will be. <laughs> so, you just gotta be generous with it, especially if you still feel like you need the glow. Hmm. And don't make a lot of facial expressions while this dries, because your makeup might crease if you do that. So try not to smile, frown or whatever. Okay, I did my eyes and my lips off camera. And this is the finished look. I'm going to zoom you a little bit so you can see how my skin looks. And as you can see, even if my skin is dry and lacks that natural glow, with a good skincare routine and suitable makeup products, you can achieve this dewy natural glow. So as a recap, uh, you need first a good hydrating skincare routine, then you need a dewy foundation of course. But what helped me out a lot was shimmering face powders like shimmering bronzer, shimmery blush and of course highlighter. And then you need a dewy setting spray, a good amount of that. <laughs> so yeah, I like to pair this kind of a look with also a shiny lip and a shimmer on the lid because it kind of looks put together and it's kind of the same vibe, let's say. So yeah, that's everything for today's video. I really hope it was useful for you and you learned something new. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up <laughs> uh, down below it helps my channel a lot i also reached 400 subscribers which i'm so thankful for thank you guys for subscribing to my channel and i'm so happy <laughs> if you reached to this point thank you so much for watching this video i upload videos every monday and friday so i hope i'll see you in my next video bye <laughs>